Hello everyone, welcome to another series of To The Point. Today's topic of discussion is Air Quality Index that is AQI. First of all, let's see why is it in the news. Recently, Delhi's Air Quality Index that is AQI is deteriorating day by day. Now let's discuss what is AQI or Air Quality Index. It was launched in 2014 with outline one number, one color, one description for the common man to judge the air quality within his vicinity. It has been developed by the Central Pollution Control Board in consultation with IIT Kanpur. The measurement of air quality is based on eight pollutants, namely particulate matter or PM10, particulate matter or PM2.5, nitrogen dioxide or NO2, sulfur dioxide SO2, carbon monoxide CO, ozone O3, ammonia NH3 and lead that is PB. AQI has six categories of air quality. These are good that is green, AQI 0 to 50, quality of air is clean, satisfactory, light green, AQI 51 to 100, this might cause some uneasiness in breathing for people with respiratory diseases, moderate air quality that is pink, AQI 101 to 200, moderate air pollution and may cause respiratory diseases on prolonged exposure, poor, yellow, AQI 210 to 300, respiratory uneasiness even in healthy people, very poor or red, AQI 301 to 400, high particulate matter levels and harmful gases which lead to the development of respiratory diseases on prolonged exposure known as chronic effects and severe that is dark red, AQI 401 to 500, Direct effects on health like allergies, rashes, skin problems and more severe respiratory diseases. Now let's discuss about Graded Response Action Plan or GRAP. GRAP has been prepared pursuant to the Supreme Court's order in the matter of MC Mehta versus Union of India 2016. The GRAP is categorized or graded into four major classes based on the air quality index of a place. Severe plus or emergency. This category is applied when it is PM2.5 and PM10 values equal to or more than 300 micrograms per cubic meter air and 500 micrograms per cubic meter air respectively. It persists in the air for more than 48 hours. Measures include the entry of truck traffic except those of essential commodities into Delhi should be stopped. GRAP also directs to stop all construction activities. Odd and even scheme of parking of private vehicles in Delhi must be applied and a task force is also set up to take emergency decisions like the shutdown of schools. Next is severe. This category is applied when the PM2.5 and PM10 concentrations are 250 micrograms per cubic meter air and 430 micrograms per cubic meter air respectively. Measures include stone crusher industries, brick kilns, hot mix plants, etc. are to be closed. Coal-based thermal power plant usage is minimized and natural gas power plants are encouraged to reduce particulate matter emissions into the air. Different timings for different types of vehicles to reduce peak traffic and the roads with high dust generation production are frequently watered to reduce dust being carried away with air. Very poor. When PM2.5 concentration is between the range of 121 to 250 micrograms per cubic meter air and PM10 concentrations are between 351 to 430 micrograms per cubic meter air. Measures are generators running on diesel are to be stopped, private vehicle parking fees hiked and the use of public transportation services are encouraged. Coal and firewood are not permitted to be used. 
citizens with respiratory and cardiac problems are advised to avoid travel and moderate to poor it is applied when pm 2.5 levels are between 61 to 120 micrograms per cubic meter air and pm 10 levels within 101 to 350 micrograms per cubic meter air measures include open burning of garbage in landfills open fields is banned brick kilns and stone industries are closed controlling dust production fly ash release and similar visible emissions by closing the industries banning fire crackers frequently cleaning and watering roads etc now it's time for the practice question consider the following statements regarding the aqi or air quality index one it was launched with the outline one number one color one description two the measurement of air quality is based on eight pollutants namely particulate matters sulfur dioxide carbon dioxide etc which of the statement or statements given above is or are correct one only two only both one and two or neither one nor two send the answer of this question in the comment section stay tuned for the next episode thanks for watching have a great day dear viewers watch this topic in hindi on our drishti ias hindi youtube channel